Hello dear ones, it's Alice. I'm of the stars. And um, I've been listening in on the internet, uh, like Claire Chatter, uh, for some years now. And I have noticed intertwining um, emotional or energetic threads of um, what they call sadomasochism, S&M, and um, uh, anal intercourse. Uh, and I just, I, today, it, it occurred to me why this appears to be happening in Earth's newosphere. Um, you know that, that the body has axiotonal lines uh, of light, and these, uh, these connect from the, the entire soul field and beyond into the physical body, all the way down through the subtle bodies and into the physical body, and and like arrange things within it, you know, arrange the way the energy flow is. Well, it apparently uh, what happens when when anal intercourse occurs is that two lines get crossed. The line of territorial aggression, which has to do with um, the basal chakra, the the first chakra. And uh, the line of of sexual aggression, which has to do with the second chakra. So there's um, w one or two tiny little axiotonal lines of light that get kinked like or, or glommed or stuck together. And that's because of the very strong reinforcement of, of pleasure that is felt. Actually, two things. Pleasure from the point of view of the person who performs anal sex and this physical discomfort for the person that that um, that is the recipient of anal sex. So, so the feelings that are taking place, the energies that are taking place during that act have to do with uh, the life being threatened for the recipient and like territorial and sexual aggression for the person that that's acting out that um, that action. And then there's intermixed with that the feelings of um, strong feelings of pleasure and physical discomfort, pleasure on the one side and physical discomfort on the other. And then the overall umbrella of sexual um, attraction. You know, so 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 that's how that happens is there's an energy glomming or thread uh, connection that's taking place because because of this act. And it seems to me that that is one of the things that's currently clearing and like unkinking and resolving into to the proper lines of light right now. So that's a very good thing. And I'm hoping that that all of this clearing work, which involves uh, the very deep drives of territorial aggression and sexual aggression, having to do with the reptilian mind, um, that are clearing right now through Earth, will will go along smoothly and and with ease now on through the summer solstice. Um, there is one other thing to consider about the after effects of, of anal intercourse, and that has to do with mouth speak. Uh, I mentioned before that recurring phrase that is heard as a repressed, like mm, somewhat ne negative, sometimes very negative, sometimes mildly negative energy in the newosphere to do with the first chakra negative. And, and that's the, the phrase that goes, I, I can't say it completely online, but it's, it's F dot dot dot, you in the B dot 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 H dot dot dot, if you get me. So, so I hear that quite a bit. And, and it's a change up, a, a better change up from what used to be on, on the internet, be heard a lot in the big city uh, areas. And that that old one that was much more um, damaging to the psyche, uh, to the emotional body, was 
F dot 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 U in the A dot dot H dot dot dot. So so the change up is more like benevolent, less less damaging. Uh, it's more like stated with more of an energy of childish mischievousness. So so that's that's a good thing that the energies have changed and and maybe because of of the recent uh, gateway, partly, the energies have changed to this more like childlike play thing uh, than they were before. It used to be male competition stuff, very, that kind of energy, just very uh, like strikingly strong male competitiveness, and so which is often found in the business world, for instance, has been until now. So anyway, there's this malware that gets attached. Because the action that's occurring is just that. The action of anal intercourse that's occurring is just that. Uh, the same as that malware. So, um, so, so all day long, the first chakra negative is, 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 is like speaking that, that malware uh, in the event certain stimuli come up. So um, the problem with the malware is that for, for the person who has been the recipient of anal intercourse, a problem with the malware is that it causes a kind of a shudder reaction in the emotional body um, in the terms of the fight or flight syndrome, it produces flight. And this creates anxiety attacks or a, a feeling of generalized anxiety. And this feeling of anxiety lowers the ability of the immune system to respond appropriately to to like um, threats to the physical health so so consequently for the person who is um, the recipient of anal intercourse over time um, the mouth speak builds up and creates more and more of a stress on the immune system and unfortunately makes the immune system more susceptible to viruses such as the HIV virus and the hepatitis uh, strains and flu and all kinds of viruses. Of course, all of this is is hypothetical and based on clear chatter and so forth. It needs to be um, these series need to be tested in um, a peer reviewed environment, uh, maybe through statistical analysis and so forth. And uh, but in general, I'd say that the clear point of view is that from uh, it seems that the main thing to eliminate viruses may be to eliminate mouth speak that's attached to the etheric net and, and other subtle bodies. So, so, um, so the first thing to do is to remove the stimulus that creates that um, locus on the etheric net <clears throat> where the malware, where the mouth speak can be attached. And then the second, the very next thing is to start cleaning up the mouth speak with the languages of light and sound. So, so there's that.